My favorite space robots, the Astrobees, were not the first floating robots to call the International Space Station home. Meet the Spheres, launched to station in 2006. And if they look familiar, it's because they were inspired by the floating droid that battled Luke Skywalker in Star Wars. So they're called Spheres because, yes, they are spheres, but it also stands for Synchronize, Position, Hold, Engage, Reorient, Experimental Satellites, because you know NASA cannot resist a complicated acronym. And they performed more than 600 experiments aboard the ISS over more than a decade. And the spheres studied a lot of things like robotic control systems, and they actually did a lot of student experiments and competitions. Personally, the spheres slosh experiment was one of my favorite that they ever did, which could help us understand more how fuel might move in fuel tanks in space. And what we learn from them has been applied to the astrobees. And the astrobees are more robot-like, while the spheres were more satellite-like. The astrobees are more designed to be astronaut assistants, while the spheres weren't meant to interact much with the crew or the environment.